The next question, my name is Muhammad Salman. I am a student and I am from Sunsari, Nepal. I have a question about praying to Jesus, peace be upon him. Jesus, peace be upon him, in his whole life said, there is only one God we should worship. Then why the Christians started worshipping Jesus, peace be upon him, which is haram in the concept of Jesus, peace be upon him too. I hope you will clear my doubt. There is not a single unequivocal statement, not a single unambiguous statement in the complete Bible where Jesus Christ, peace be upon him, himself says, I am God, or where he says, worship me. Jesus Christ, peace be upon him, he was one of the mightiest messengers of God. And Jesus Christ, peace be upon him, he never claimed divinity. In fact, if you read the Bible, Jesus Christ, peace be upon him, said, it is mentioned in the Gospel of John, chapter number 10, verse number 29, my father is greater than all. Gospel of Matthew, chapter number 12, verse number 28, I cast out devils with the Spirit of God. Gospel of Luke, chapter number 11, verse number 20, I with the finger of God cast out devils. Gospel of John, chapter number 5, verse number 30, I can of my own self do nothing. As I hear, I judge, and my judgment is just, for I seek not my will, but the will of Almighty God. Anyone who says, I seek not my will, but the will of Almighty God, he is a Muslim. Jesus Christ, peace be upon him, was a Muslim. And Jesus Christ, peace be upon him, he never claimed divinity. In fact, if you read, it is mentioned in the Gospel of Matthew, chapter number 5, verse number 17, 20. Jesus Christ, peace be upon him, said, Think not, I have come to destroy the law or the prophets. I have come not to destroy, but to fulfill. For till the heavens and the earth shall pass, not one jot or tittle of the law or the commandments shall be broken. For if anyone breaks one of the least of the commandments and teaches men to do so, he shall be called least in the kingdom of heaven. For if anyone keeps the commandments and teaches men to do so, he shall be called great in the kingdom of heaven. Unless your righteousness exceeds the righteousness of the scribes and the Pharisees, in no way shall you enter the kingdom of heaven. So Jesus Christ, peace be upon him. He did not say that if you want to enter the kingdom of heaven, believe that I am God, believe that I died on the cross for the sins. But he rather said that if you want to enter the kingdom of heaven, you must keep the commandments. It is mentioned in the Gospel of Matthew, chapter number 19, verse number 16 and 17. A man approaches Jesus Christ, peace be upon him, and he asks him, O oh, good master, what good thing I should do that I shall attain eternal life? Jesus Christ, peace be upon him, replies and says, Why thou call it me good? There is only one good, and that is the Father in heaven, that is Almighty God. And if you want to enter eternal life, you must keep the commandments. So Jesus Christ, peace be upon him, he never claimed divinity. Leave aside calling Jesus Christ, peace be upon him as almighty God. Jesus Christ, peace be upon him, told this person, why thou call it me good? There is only one good and that is almighty God. And it is clearly mentioned in the book of Acts, chapter number 2, verse number 22. Ye men of Israel, listen to this. Jesus of Nazareth, a man approved of God amongst you, by wonders and miracles and signs, which God did by him and you are witness to it. So Jesus Christ, peace be upon him, he never claimed divinity. Now coming back to your question, that why the Christians, they pray to Jesus Christ, peace be upon him. And there are many Christians who say that Jesus Christ, peace be upon him, he is almighty God. They believe Jesus Christ, peace be upon him, he is almighty God. As I mentioned earlier, that there is not a single unequivocal statement, not a single unambiguous statement in the complete Bible where Jesus Christ, peace be upon him, himself says, I am God, or where he says, worship me. In fact, there is a red letter Bible, wherein all the words of Jesus Christ, peace be upon him, they are mentioned in red color. So even in this version of the Bible, you will not find any statement wherein Jesus Christ, peace be upon him, himself said, I am God, or where he says, worship me. So why the Christians, they pray to Jesus Christ, peace be upon him. Why they believe that he is almighty God? The reason is that the church later on changed many teachings of the Bible. And later on when St. Paul came, he changed many teachings of the Bible. And the Christians, they follow the church. Wherein the church, it promotes and says that Jesus is almighty God. Jesus Christ, peace be upon him, he died on the cross for the sins. The Christians, they claim that the Bible is the word of Almighty God. So, if they consider the Bible to be the word of Almighty God, they should believe in the Bible rather than believing in the church. But unfortunately, 
many of the Christians today, they do not read their Holy Scripture. They do not read the Bible. And they rely more on the teachings of the church rather than reading the Bible. So I would request the Christian brothers and sisters that to go back to your Holy Scriptures, read the Bible. And if you read the Bible, you shall understand the concept of God in Christianity. That you have to worship only one God and you have to worship Him alone.